Steven Lux talks about the second phase of power and that is non-decision making. So what does this non-decision making means? It means that a person or a group of person are preventing certain issue from being discussed. And even if that particular issue is being discussed, the course of alternatives are restricted. For example, suppose the capitalist economy is there, yet the government wants to introduce certain labor reforms which is beneficial for the industrial workers. But because of the pressure by the capitalist lobby, the government is not able to discuss that particular topic that is labor reforms in the parliament. So to that extent, capitalists are more powerful compared to the government. And even if government is able to discuss anything with respect to labor reforms, they have a limited number of alternatives. Like government cannot introduce the clause of job security because capitalists want to hire and fire the labor as per their whims and fancies. So again, to that extent, capitalists are more powerful compared to the government here. So this is what non-decision making the second phase of power as per Stephen Lukes.